Hobbit Hut video, end of week 9 and 10. Uh, we missed uh, the end of week 9 because we had a snowstorm on the Sunday, so it wasn't uh, worth shoveling out and trying to get one located. Uh, we've had some warm weather the last couple of days, so the snow is, uh, as you can see, starting to melt. Um, we've got a lot done in the last couple of weeks. Uh, all the, all the uh, excavation has been, the, the, the dirt's all been put back in place, plus we had a lot left over, which we filled in a bunch of low-lying areas here between the well and the house has been filled in. Uh, we've still got a little bit of garbage to get rid of and uh, need some new gravel in the driveway because it's all gravel and mud now. Uh, as you can see by the house, I'm not sure about the sun there, but the uh, house all has the, the new windows in it now, so it's looking pretty good from out here. A friend and Scott and I popped those in at the end of week nine. Uh, so anyway, the uh, Charging on the outside is all complete around the house, so the foundation is totally finished and uh, been backfilled and tidied up, so looking good there. Uh, we'll go ahead and uh, go inside. Uh, lots of changes happening in here. So as you come in, you'll notice in, in every room as the drywall has all been stacked in here, so the guys are going to start doing that start doing the drywall tomorrow. So I've been going like crazy getting everything done. All the vapor barrier, I've been working on the vapor barrier insulation all this week. So it's all complete and it was inspected on Friday morning. Um, the guys came and put the resilient channel on the ceiling. You can see all that metal channel that uh, helps to level out uh, the undulations <laughs> in, the, uh, in the ceiling. So it helps to flatten it out a little bit and make it look a little tidier. Uh, one big change here was we had the fireplace sandblasted. We had a, made a big room plastic all off and uh, the guy came on a Tuesday morning and uh, sandblasted that so it looked turned out really well. It's a little gray right now. Uh, it's still got quite a bit of dust on it so we're going to vacuum that off and then we'll put a sealer on the stone and then all the red stone that's in it actually doesn't look really dark right now, but once it's got the sealer on it, it'll really darken up and uh, look a lot better. So as you can see from inside, uh, the windows uh, look real nice. So it's really bright in the house now. So, um, you know, when lots of light coming in, lots of, uh, you know, lots of, lots of outside looking in. So that's great. Um, very happy with the way everything's turned out. Plumbing, electrical, all complete. So just waiting uh, for the guys tomorrow. Uh, we got the tub put in this week. So that's the tub in the main bath is all finished. Uh, the ventilation up through the roof, that, that cardboard little box there, that's just temporary. And then the fan goes in there. So it'll be uh, vented and uh, it'll get rid of steam and stuff. Uh, the window in the uh, little spare room here, cut that in uh, about a week and a half ago because it was uh, just, uh, you know, the old siding was still on there. So cut that in. So this is a nice, uh, nice window for this little room. Uh, the only thing left to do between now and tomorrow is this uh, wall in the ensuite. The ensuite bath is there. And uh, this wall here where the uh, tub uh, is going to go ahead and insulate both of those walls uh, for soundproofing so uh, you know if you have company or anything like that uh, you know you're not you're not disturbing somebody if you're having a shower whatever so that gives you a pretty good idea how things look in here so anyway uh, nothing gone gone on downstairs we have basically downstairs is a war zone because we're moving all the tools and everything that were up here moving everything uh, downstairs to get it out of the way for uh, the drywaller. So anyway, that's the uh, end of week 9 and 10. Uh, hope uh, you're uh, enjoying uh, what's going on here. And uh, after the drywall is done, I think uh, it's really going to define, uh, you know, the way the rooms look. So anyway, stay tuned for uh, week 11, I guess. Thanks.